Hello everyone. In the previous lecture, we had learned how to display array elements using pointers, right? So now in this lecture, we'll try to print the same array values in reverse order by using your pointer variable, right? So for this first, what we are trying to do is, uh, as usual, we are moving on with our hash include stdio.h and then starting with your void main, I'm declaring few variables like n, i, array of size 15 I had given. So within 15, whatever the value you want it to give, that one you can give. And then I'm creating a pointer variable because by using this pointer variable, I need to print those values in the reverse order. So first I'm asking user to enter uh, print elements in uh, that is what simple statement. I just wanted to give that we are trying to print the elements in reverse order. Next I'm asking user to give the in number of input uh, array size. That is what is the value you wanted to give for the array size that one you are reading into the n variable next up pt is equals to pt is nothing but our pointer variable so that is the reason we are here we are using ampersand symbol that is you are trying to store the address of array one into the variable pt right so what is this base address is nothing but your first address if i give array value as five the first value will be stored into the first pt right and then next up printf how many number of values you want so if i declare n value uh, array value as n the first value has to go into that right the total array size will be as a pointer address right pointer variable so that one we are assigning there and then coming back here in the second one we are trying to read n number of values so that one i am just giving for i is equals to zero i less than n i plus plus so we are checking zero is less than n condition is true print f percentile d so which number i was just trying to print it as zero at the value or second the third what value i'm just wanted to read that one i'm just uh, giving with the element number that is the reason here i had given plus i plus one so that you will tell that it is first number second number third number which is being stored into your uh, array right so here what is happening i had given scanf percentile d pt so for pt uh, initially i had initialized its value to zero at the uh, value of the array right so whatever the value is there that one will be stored into pt now next what i am doing i am assigning pt is equals to ampersand array of n minus 1 so if i give my n value as 5 uh, your array values will be 4 because internally counting starts from 0 right so that is the reason you had given there n minus 1 and then next what we are trying to do printf the elements of the array in reverse order so now actual logic comes here how to print the elements in reverse order so it is very simple uh, almost all uh, maximum for loops will uh, initialize is i with zero that is you are telling that you'll be starting from zero th element to nth element here what we are trying to do we want from nth element to zero th element so for that reason for i is equals to n you will do and you will check out the condition i less than zero so until and unless i less, <coughs> less than zero it will become it will try to print the values and the other one more thing you need to remember here is pointer pt right as i said we are using the pointers see here i had given a pointer variable and i is the location that is first element or second element and simply you are uh, decrementing the pt value so each time your pt pointer will move from highest value to lowest level lowest level lowest level like that it will reach to the zeroth element and then it will quit from your for loop and then from your main program right so this is what is happening in our program so let us just save this control s and then compile the code no errors and then run your code uh yes print print the elements of an array in reverse order so that is what we are we are doing in our code next input the number of element to store maximum 50 because i had declared my array as 15 size right so i'm just giving uh, five next input five numbers of elements into the array so here it is asking what is the element one i'm giving to well next it will ask second third one fourth five six fifth six so five elements i had given next it will print the same thing in reverse order the elements of arrays in reverse order element fifth is six fourth is five third position you are having one second position you are having three and at element one you are having the value 12 
this is how you are trying to print the array elements in reverse order by using your pointer variable right so i hope this uh, video is clear and the program is also clear for everyone right thank you for all